Hi, Dr. Pelto here. I just want to go over a question that uh, someone had uh, about Athena, and specifically it's how to link procedures to um, the actual named procedures. So I want to go, uh, basically the way you get here is you go click on this little, uh, this little gear, you go to clinicals, and then clinicals, there's two different areas that we want to look at. One is procedures, and this is where you actually put in all the different procedures that you do, debridum of skin, all, all the different procedures. Basically, you put in the procedures here, and what it's going to show up as is the procedure, and then if it's right, if it's left, um, where you're doing it at. So once you have all the procedures in here, okay, uh, you give it the name, you save it, then you have to link it. You have to link it to the procedure code. So further down here, you can see order type and procedure template mapping. So mapping is where it's gonna link the two. So you see here uh, an order and then the procedures, and specifically we were talking about like debridement codes. And then it, debri it, it combines it with the actual procedural code right here. And this is actually pulled in directly from uh, the, 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 the app here, or this, this uh, app. So if you click, it says the procedure right up here, and then the procedure code 11042, and all the other verbiage actually pulls in automatically. So all of these procedure codes need to be mapped or need to be linked to the actual procedure. So if you're doing like an incision and drainage of a perinicia, and then it goes to this code, um, so you have the, the procedure code and then what it's linked to in your EMR. So I hope that helps to understand a little bit more uh, about how to, how to do this mapping and, and sharing of these procedure codes.